Dude, look at this kid. Yeah. I fertilized the whole entire field. I just wanted to explain where I've been and why haven't I have been vlogging as much. What is up guys, it's your boy Steven Kinez, back at it again. Guys, your boy is back. Dude, it's a beautiful day in Hollywood, California right now, man. It's like December, it's like 65 degrees over here. We're getting all kinds of training in, man. We're going to the field today, we're gonna hit. We're gonna lift some weights, get those gains, baby. I'm psyched to finally be back, man. I've been kind of focusing on my training and everything. It's time to bring the vlog back, time to bring the Valley Boys back. I know I've been starving you guys for content, but yeah, if you guys are new here, make sure you guys press the like button, make sure you guys press the subscribe button. But first, let's get it, baby, cue the intro. Yeah, guys, Thomas is about to get here, and I am not ready. So, yeah, I'm gonna grab my stuff. You guys already know I got the full drip on. I got the pit vipers. got the chains. I gotta go full drip for my first day back. Yo, before I go to the field, let's say what up to Lou Dog. Louie? Aw, look at Louie. He's waiting for me. Dude, we already got presents, man. Bro, it's already Christmas. How insane is that, man? 2020 feels like it's been like a marathon year. We got Louie. Aw, look at this foo. Louie, don't look your nuts. All right, guys, you already know. I just had to say hi to that foo. And uh, yes, sir, let us get the balls, because without the balls, we cannot do fly balls or ground balls. Gate open. We got Savage Medicine Ball there. Shout out to Coach Goose. Dude, I'm hyped because me and Thomas are going on Coach Goose's program starting next week. So yeah, this is the week. We're gonna ramp up all the long toss. We're gonna go hard training. Me and Alec lifting sessions are gonna go even harder. But uh, yeah, I kinda need two hands to grab these balls, so. Hey, I'll grab you, all right? Let's just take a second to admire this beautiful cage work. It's a work of art. We're gonna be hitting in you later today, baby. All right, I'm gonna be in Thomas's car in three, two, one. What is up, guys? We got your boy, TK, back in action. What can I say? Oh, what is going on over here? What the heck? But like I said guys, we're on our way to the field. Got the pit vipers on, ready to go. Gotta go to a public park, you know, because we can't work out at school. Thank you, Eric Garcetti. <laughs> Baseball players in SoCal are kind of screwed right now, man. Most of everything are closed. We just gotta finesse like some true valley boys, man. Juco bandits. Some Juco bandits. Shout out Eric Sim. Dude, I think Eric Sim should run for mayor, not Mayor Garcetti. They should just swap, right? I'd vote for him. Guys, we are at the field. We decided to go to a new field today. But dude, we're here. I think you guys can smell that from here, man. They just decided to fertilize the whole entire field over the weekend, man. It smells worse than the time we stopped at Taco Bell on that long bus trip. <laughs> should we do, bro? Should we go all the way like 20, 30 minutes to the other field? No. We're about to pivot to the next field and let's get it. All right, guys, we just found another field. Yeah, we're gonna get some long toss and we're gonna get some field work. What up, Thomas? You got anything to say? Whoa, dude. What's up? You got something on your face, man. On my, on my nose? Yeah. Yeah, it's sunscreen. Dude. I'm doing Larry the Lobster. Living like Larry, bro. Living like Larry. That's it. Can I take this off now? Or, uh, yeah, yeah. Joke over. We got we got the bit. Okay, thank you. <laughs> All right, guys, we're going to do some mobility stuff. Right, let's get a bait for the boys by the boys. Guys, you never know who's watching, man. We got the scouts in the stands. Isn't that right, Thomas? Yeah, those are scouts. Those are definitely not homeless individuals. Those are scouts. <laughs> all right, guys, we just uh, finished stretching and mobility, all that stuff. We're gonna do some bands, and then we're gonna get this long toss in. Many tic tacs later. All right, guys, we just finished long toss. Comment below if you guys think Thomas should keep growing the flow, or you think he should uh, like go full like caveman mode, or should we get him like a super sick haircut and Have make you been him filming this whole time? Make him look like Jon Snow or something. Kind of just discovered this sick field, so we'll do some ground balls, maybe do some fly. Eyeballs. It looks like there's room. It's better than a manure field, huh? Yeah, dude, it is. Guys, please help me. He makes me film these. He makes me like help him out and like, I need help, guys, please. Why you gotta tell them that, man? Bro, I'm tired of this like, I'm so, I just wanna work out, dude. Ooh. Ay, yeah, yeah, that was some good reps right there. Thank you, good sir. Did you know that about this field? What? It's a no-fly zone, apparently. It's a no-fly zone. You guys already know. The only time Steven dropped his balls when he hit puberty, all right? <laughs> hey, 
He's not wrong. Like, you think he has more hair than I do? Bro, you're homeless. Dude, why do these two people hang out with all the time? Both look homeless. Bro, you need to get a haircut. This is what quarantine does to you, man. Jeez. <laughs> As a Christmas present, I'm paying for a very expensive haircut slash beard cut. I'm hooking the boy up, my guy Eli the barber. This video is sponsored by SeatGeek. All right, so we're gonna do a before and after in three, two. Bro, look at this kid. Oh my god. Does it look good? Dude, bro, you got the fade. Dude, look at this kid. Dude. Well done. Thomas, are you next? Are you next? I'm next. I think you need it more Wait, than I do. Let me get that card. <laughs> let me get the card they gave you. Yeah. Look at this kid, man. He looks like a little movie star. Looks like he can actually talk to a girl now. Oh! <laughs> What'd you say? I don't have the shit on him. That's what he means to me now. Yeah, yeah. Uh, bro, Thomas, did you actually think that was Madison no, Beer? No, 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 no. Play the TikTok, bro. Oh, I know. Dude, that is James Charles. Shut up. Thomas relax, thought relax, this was Madison relax, Beer, relax, bro. Relax, That's James Charles. Relax, relax. Guys, I don't think I've ever been more hungry in my life. Me and Thomas were working out since like 10.30. It is 5 p.m. and I am about to eat a house. This is technically gonna be my lunch. Yeah, I left over some last night. We got the veggie burgers. Dude, look at that beautiful meal. It's simple, but it's just amazing. This food is gonna turn directly into gains. Gonna work out like an hour or so after this. But yeah, I'm gonna swallow this meal whole. I'm gonna get back to you in a sec. You guys already know, in the Valley Boys garage with your boy, Alec. Dude! Yeah, that <laughs> happened. Dude, that's the cat man right there. All I gotta say is, you don't need to swallow sh beast mode. <laughs> Young boy. Dude, I can't get copyrighted for this, man. But yeah, guys, we are going to lift right now. We're gonna get those gains, baby. We got bench today. I got some Eric Sim smelling salt. You guys already know. Gonna get some pre-workout in. But yeah, let's get it for the boys, for the Valley Boys, baby. You got those gains or what, bro? Yeah, of course, dude. You don't freaking swole sh man. Look at this. Yeah. That's a swole man, dude. Look at those tats, bro, guys. Look how detailed his whole sleeve is, man. Pretty crazy. Is what it is. Alright, guys, like I said, just got those gains. The chest day, a little bit of triceps. I'm gonna do some calves, a little bit of my spare time after this. Before that, I gotta update all you guys on what's been going on, how come I haven't been posting, what I've been doing in the meantime. And yeah, let's get right into that. Alrighty, guys. <sighs> I just wanted to explain where I've been and why haven't I been vlogging as much. And yeah, there are a couple reasons for that. And yeah, off the top of my head, guys, I've been going to the field of the cage every dang day. And that's not an exaggeration. Dude, I've been chasing nothing but perfection. All my swing and my mechanics and stuff for my throw and my head have been lifted a ton. Honestly, guys, I've been just putting my head down and just straight working. I haven't really been posting on social media a lot because, man, I wasn't where I wanted to be. I kind of just didn't feel like putting the cameras up for me. And I just wanted to work in silence a little bit, you know? I've also been going to a bunch of showcases as well. I went to two big ones. I went to the Baseball Census Juco Showcase and I went to the Top Prospect Best of the West Showcase. And dude, I did really well, man. I'm psyched in the Baseball Census Showcase. I went like one for two with a double in the gap. So yeah, that was pretty dope. It was a pretty cool experience. Play at San Manuel. It's like a minor league stadium. Um, I've been posting a bunch on Twitter. I'm trying to get recruited to a four-year school. You guys could actually help me out. Go ahead and retweet some of my stuff. Go ahead and follow me on Twitter. You guys could be the ones to get me recruited. The head coach sees that based off your retweet. How dope would that be, man? But yeah, anyways, I've also had a bunch of time to reflect on like why I do this, man. There's a lot of college baseball players out there and there is not a lot of college baseball YouTubers. And that's for a reason, man. It's tough. It's a lot of work. I'm literally one of the only ones who do it 
it. Believe me guys, the views and the numbers are great. I do this to document my journey and I do this to motivate, inspire, and entertain all of you guys. I try to bring some joy into like 10 minutes of your day. I don't wanna say I'm built different, man. But I'm a valley boy. To get things done. I've always had this YouTube channel, man. I've been just trying to wrap my mind around how I can give you guys the best content while also making sure I eat, sleep, and breathe like a major league caliber athlete. Cause I want nothing the best for myself, my health, and my mental health. And I also wanna please you guys, you know? So I've surrounded myself with a real good group behind the scenes. And yeah, man, I'm gonna start getting stuff done. I'm super psyched coming, especially into the new year. I'm gonna keep my pace of training like an athlete. I mean, you know, regardless or not, if we even have a season, I'll probably get into that in a video later. But I'm gonna step up my whole YouTube and TikTok game up. So yeah, man, 2021 is gonna be a fun journey. If you guys are watching this, I actually filmed this yesterday. I pumped this out myself just to get back on the horse, man. Also, to show my dedication, guys, look at this, baby. I got a Valley Horse tattoo. Right on the quad, baby. Just so I can always look down and remind myself, like, what I do this for. I do this for the Valley Boys, man. If you guys are riding or dying with me, make sure you guys comment down hashtag Valley Boys. But yeah, guys, speaking of Valley Boys, we're actually doing an end of the year sale by the time this video comes out. And on midnight of January 1st, we're doing sales on the website up to 50% off. So make sure you guys get your butts over there. Everything on the website is 25% off. For the Kinez Crew shirts and hoodies, if you guys apply the code 2020, you're gonna get 50% off on that bad boy. Yeah, guys, go start yourself out strong. Get some Valley Boys merch. The sickest merch in the game, you guys already know. Yeah, guys, like I said, I'm super stoked to be back on YouTube, man. Make sure you guys press the subscribe button. Make sure you guys follow me on all platforms. Yeah, guys, that's gonna be that in the video today. See you guys in the next one. Peace. Oh, you foos.